What is going on guys today? We have got Centurion's Danilo Pereira, the 86 CDM from PSG, has had a little bit of an upgrade. So in this, if you didn't have enough XP, I'm certainly, certainly think you will now. 1,000 for three of the objectives. So let's see what we've got to do. Scores in six matches, well, scores six goals in squad battles using Portuguese players. Fair enough. Assists four goals using League 1 players in squad battles again. Concede one or less goals per match in three separate matches. And win six matches with a minimum of three League 1 players. Very easy. We get an 80 times 2. Very nice. 1,000 XP. Uh, we get 78 times 2. Small Electrum. And a gold players. And then at the end of it, we get this beautiful 3-star, free 3-star free Pereira. 6 foot 2 lengthy. Pretty standard. Uh, CDM or centre-back. Could you play him at centre-back? 89 physical, 86 defending. You go a shadow. You're looking at, what, 80... 83 pace, 83 pace, you're looking at like at least 89, 90 defending, I'd say. You've already got good strength. Composure is debatable, agility balance for a centre-back. I mean, you could, to be fair. Like, genuinely, he could be a centre-back. How tall? 6'2", so... I mean, he's got the multiple uses there. He's got power header, he's got pinged pass and intercept, and also aerial as his playstyles. No playstyle plus for him, unfortunately. That's an interesting one with a position for him, to be honest. More than likely, you'd go with the CDM, hold him right in the CDM role, rather than necessarily kind of bursting forward. You'd want him literally holding that defensive line, almost like a centre-back anyway. It's not a bad card. I mean, it's not going to be one that's going to feature in a lot of main teams, I can imagine. But for a league gun team, definitely not the worst. So in terms of what would I go for first, the six goals and the four assists is straight away you can do in one game. Perfect. If you can concede one or less goals, I'd go just squad battle straight out the bat or even foot champs, to be fair. You can get that done literally with a rage quit straight off the bat. So I wouldn't worry too much about that one. I'd just go a, a, go a, a, a kind of a, a, with my day, really. I'd be doing foot champs. I'd get that done at the same time. You don't need any sort of players in that, so that's fine. With the final one, three league gun players. Do I have... Free league gun. Dembele's one. FC24 is here and Sky Coach has all your needs covered. From squad battles, champs, qualifications, and even now draft boosting, there is a long list of services they do give, as well as coaching and also the big one everybody wants in FC24 coins. The service is fast and reliable and you will get your coins, your boosting services or obviously coaching in a matter of hours. If you do want to get any of these, make sure you head over to skycoach.gg, go onto the website and when you go to checkout, make sure that you are using the code JT11 at checkout for your 5% off your orders. And if you'd prefer to do this on mobile, check out the screen right now with the QR code for their mobile app. And I think that's it. So we'd have to definitely put some more in there. I could bring Kola Moane back, maybe. We'll see. So I need three league gun players. If I was doing it all in one, I'd need league gun players to assist. And I'd need Portuguese players to score. So where would I get that from? So let's have a look at what we can actually do. Also, some of the players look absolutely nuts this week. So some very, very good ones. So let's get Carlos Alberto out of there. So in terms of league gun, I could go Marquinhos... I've got Dembele already, and I'd need one more that's not on the bench. Who have I got? I know Kolo Moane is a big shout there. We've got a lot of loans, so it's Hernandez. It, it really has to be Kolo Moane for my team. In terms of loans, you, you, the obvious straight off the bat is going to be Mbappe. It's going to be Pele. It's going to be Ginola. Very expensive options. If we're going a bit cheaper... We could see, okay, we got the Road to the Knockout, I believe. Yeah, Road to the Knockout. We got Jonathan David, if you did his SBC. A Bamiyank, who is an inform. An inform, very nice. I know my stuff. Uh, Klaus is Road to the Knockout. Dynamic Duo, not a bad shout. Don't know if he's still in there, actually, but could be a shout. We've got a Trailblazer in Golovin. Matic is there as an in uh, Road to the Knockout. I know my stuff, don't worry. Hakimi, and the list keeps going. So plenty of players to get that done. The question is, what Portuguese players do I have? I don't have any on the bench, do I? As I say, I don't think I do. Let's just get rid of Lama a second. 
No, we've got no Portuguese players. So let's have a look what we got. We've got Futra and also Figo as a loan. I could just put them in for one match, get the six goals and done. We have Pedro Goncalves. Uh, we have Neves, Rafa, Bernardo. So not terrible options. Obviously, CR7 is going to be the number one shout as a striker. Unless you're going for Eusebio. You're just flexing your icons on me now. Bernardo, uh, Bruno... Uh, Bruno Fernandes has got a few cards that you could go for. Ronaldo, again, you could just go for his gold and it's fine. Liao is going to be a great shout. In fact, if you've done his player of the month, that's going to be a beautiful one. Or have got the Trailblazer. So I think that would be kind of where I'd go there. I'd probably just go Pedro for me in terms of just getting it done in one game. Get him gone. I don't need him. Once you've got the six goals, you can take him out. So realistically there, I've got Marquinhos. I'll have Kulamawane in at some point where there we'll change him there and we'll bring him over so we can get the assist then i'd more than likely just pedro gonclaves put him up front because it's only squad battle so it really doesn't matter that much grind out the first two hopefully the first match would be the uh, kind of first one i concede one or less should be relatively easy in squad battles and then it's just winning the six naturally i think with the three i could sub out kola moane and the other two can do absolutely fine going into champs get the six wins and you've done it like that I'd, I'd say the only one that I wouldn't do in champs is Portuguese because I don't really have a massive Portuguese player like a Trailblazer CR7 or a Liao who actually would score in there. Pedro Gonclaves might take a fair few games and it would wreck the chemistry of my team. So I'd get that done. I'd get the assist done for Ligon so I don't have to actually do it. Then the top defense would be easy in champs. Naturally, you'll get a few rage quits or at least you might get a 1-1 and you just take the lead at 2-1. Is always possible. And then finally with the win six, like I said, I'd just keep the Ligon guys in, get my champs done. And there we go. We've got him done. Not bad whatsoever. Not a bad player. Not going to be number one in the shout, but definitely got a, a few decent stats that you could upgrade. We'll get him on a review and see how he does. Bob Nat, let me know if you're going to complete him. Peace.